Hi, second grade, time for skills and time for more long and short vowel sounds. And today our learning target is, I can tell the difference between the long and short O sound. So we have the long O, and when it's a long vowel, it says its name. So when you're reading the word, you'll hear the sound O. And then the short O, and the sound the short O makes is ah. So, the long O is when the letter says its name. The short O is says when it says its sound, ah. So let's take a look at how it shows up in some words and see if we can listen and sort that sound, okay? So the first word, let's take a look at frog. Frog. I hear that short O, ah. It helps me to say the word slowly and listen to each sound so I can listen carefully for that vowel sound, the O sound, so I know if it's a long or short, okay? Let's try it with boat, but o but I hear a B and O right there. I hear it saying its name, so it's long. Let's see what else. Ma op. Slow m op. Short o ah. Hearing it say its sound. Snow. Snow o right away. I hear that when I say it slow, I hear the S N and O saying its name. We have two more. Let's see. Suck. Sock. You got it. That's a short O. And rose. O. Again, it's saying its name. And look, it has that magic E. When we see that magic E, most of the time it's going to make that vowel, in this case an O, say its name. Knowing the difference between the long and short O sounds is going to help you read. And be able to look at a word and know what it says because you know here it says like ah like sock or here it says its name like rose. For your activity today you are going to be given some words, you're going to read them and you are going to sort them into the long and short O sound.